everybody welcome back to my channel um today's a very special day thought i'd bring you guys along with me i just got out the shower that's why i'm looking like this obviously um today i'm gonna meet niall horan from one direction if you guys know me you know how obsessed i am with one direction how obsessed obsessed as you can tell and um, so i'm meeting him and i wanted to vlog it for larry as well and i have to finish some work today i have to do some work around the house and then i'm meeting up with my friend Alyssa. I'm meeting now with Alyssa. we're gonna go to eat breakfast and then we're gonna come back get ready at my house and then we're off to the concert and yeah so i'll bring you guys along the whole day so hope you guys like it hope you guys are entertained i'm still learning like i said i'm still learning all the angles how to work this but whatever so this is me now just wait until my outfit later just wait this is how excited i am for today super excited i'm excited been nervous because if you guys never been to a meet and greet usually meet and greets are like 10 seconds long so you only have so much to say and even though you have it planned in your head what to say it never goes it, it just never turns out that way and it sucks so yeah i'm trying to keep calm so i won't you know, sounds stupid to him. I'm excited. I'm nervous. I'm really nervous because I just don't want to fuck it up. Last time I met him, I, I told him to, to have my babies. It, it just came out of my mouth. I did not plan that. It just came out of my mouth. I was like, no, have my babies. And it was his reaction was so funny. He lifted me up out of my feet. Like He just gave me the biggest hug he held me for like 10 seconds and just rubbed my back and oh oh no i'm sweating but yeah so hopefully today goes good i don't know about you guys but when i get nervous or excited i gag like i got i've been gagging since this morning is that normal i don't know i just keep gagging i'm just so anxious i hope my makeup looks good i hope my hair turns out fine i just i don't know i'm just also scared because it's general admission i don't do well with general admission if you guys don't know i suffer with anxiety and just being around that like gets me anxious and i get panic attacks and i'm just a mess so Hopefully I don't have anything like that today. Hopefully I'm calm. Hopefully I'm relaxed. I'm just, I'm praying. I'm praying I'm not a hot mess today. I will get an alcoholic drink. Alcoholic drink calms me down. Like one, I'm not gonna get drunk today. Not today. But yeah, so I'm gonna get like one, like probably a margarita. I've been craving a margarita. So hopefully it works. Hopefully it calms me down. I do have another video I'm gonna make about my anxiety, so stay tuned. I, uh, I just, I'm not gonna talk about it. Let's just stay tuned for that video. But yeah, that one's gonna be more long. So yeah, I'm excited. I'm waiting for Alyssa. Alyssa's gonna pick me up in 30 minutes. We're gonna go eat. So I'll show you. Like all that shit, but I like I hate being on camera. Well, I don't know why. this is my friend Alyssa. <laughs> you just heard her. Hello. Okay, so we just got home from eating. We went to IHOP. It's time to get glam for Niall. I'm gonna do my hair first. I'm gonna curl it. She's gonna do her makeup and we'll see from there. On our way. Did he record? <laughs> We're on our way. This is our outfits. I'm not showing anymore. <laughs> um, yeah. We're ready. I'm excited. We're excited. I'm not nervous anymore. I'm more excited now. Probably like in an hour and a half, we should be meeting him. We have to check in first. Oh man, I didn't brush my teeth. I'll brush them in the morning, but I like to brush my teeth after um, makeup. Yeah, and stuff. <laughs> but yeah, oh well. Oh. So yeah, we're on our way. We're 
almost there. We live pretty close to the venue. It's at the Palms. And so we'll see you inside. You want to go? Okay, now we're waiting to get in. How do you feel? I'm excited. How do your feet hurt? We're wearing heels, guys. They hurt. <laughs> we're both wearing heels. Good. This alcoholic drink should help. We are all waiting. <laughs> Following each other. Pause the moment for Jeffree Star. We all follow each other on Insta. Instagram. Oh. New friends. I covered up. <laughs> um, we're just waiting to get in line to the venue. Sound check went eh. Now I look pissed off. Sadly. My question wasn't answered. Oh. Oh. The queen. The queen herself. Amazing. Now you're feeling this motherfucker. You knew me for that. Diana followed me on Twitter as well. Thank you. Thank you. You didn't compliment my basic one. No, I'm joking. We're waiting. It's currently what? 7.16? 7.17. Taco Bell. I'll tell you guys the story on why we were on in the back later. We're not drunk. We're just hungry. I'm tipsy. That's it for now. Talk to you guys later. Yay! I got to meet Niall. I got to hug him. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's talk about the experience. So, it was very unorganized. Very unorganized. So, I was confused. All the people for the meeting, great, for the meet and greet were in line. And it was like, 
I would say like over 100 people. I was like, that's a lot of people meeting now. So we got our wristbands. We check in. You got see that? Okay. So we checked in and then um, meet and greet started right away. So we didn't wait that long. I think I waited like 40 minutes after check-in to meet him. And then when we actually saw the back ground the backboard of his meeting greet that's when it hit me i started shaking i was like I, what am i gonna say what am i gonna what pose am i gonna do and like i just started freaking the fuck out like freaking out and then um it was this these girls went before me and I was talking to Mark. I don't know if, if you guys don't know Mark. Mark is the guy who's like, oh, where are we going today, Mark? You know that guy from the Wendy days? <laughs> well, yeah, I was talking to him. He's um, Niall's personal trainer. He travels with them and stuff. And I was talking to him. I was like, when you're in Vegas, you need to train me. Like, look at Niall now. Like, I need that. Like, he's like, hi, am I doing a good job? I'm like, yes, you're doing a good job. Like, train me. He's like, he just starts laughing. He's like, I got you. And then it was my turn to meet Niall. And oh my God. His eyes. Like, as you guys know, my outfit was a little showy off. And he made eye contact with my eyes, and I just see him look down. He's like, like, at, you know, my boobies. And I was like, oh, my God, my God. That made me feel, like, so, like, not, I don't know, it made me feel like, it, it made me have butterflies. And I was like, oh, my God. And then I just said oh are you enjoying vegas and he was like oh this city gets me so much in trouble and i'm just like oh and i just started laughing giggling and then it was time to pose i was like oh my god i'm gonna, gonna pose so i just posed normally i wanted to make it safe i didn't want my picture coming out like oh because there's some girls that um do like funny poses but the photographer always takes them sometimes like in the process of posing so i didn't want to risk it I wanted a cute picture with now and yeah, and then I hug him twice. I was like, oh, you're so handsome. He was so, he's so good looking. Wow. Niall fucking Horn. Oh, Niall James Horn. Ooh, ooh. So yeah, it was so rushed, really rushed. But oh, I wish I could have said, like, thank you for everything. Thank you for your hard work, but. It was just too rushed. I was, cause like the way he looked at me, that got me nervous. I was, ooh, he got me so nervous. Cause ah, I can't stop picturing that. The way he looked at me. Wow. He was shook. Cause obviously like there was little girls there. And here's me, grown ass woman meeting him. So yeah, I thought that was so funny. But yeah, it was a great experience. Let me talk to you guys about the actual concert now. Okay, so during sound check, wow, I like started crying. Like I ball like like it hit me like wow, like this guy was all over my room. Like all his his face was all over my room and it's like it sounds so cheesy, but, like, Wendy literally, like, changed my fucking life. Really, like, I've traveled all over the country for them, and it finally hit me when he was singing You and Me. I was just, like, oh. And there was, like, I would say there was, like, 150 people? No, 200 people? In Soundtrack? I believe so. I don't know. And, oh, I can't, like, oh. He looked pissed during soundtrack because these girls just kept screaming and screaming. He wouldn't let him talk. Like, they wouldn't let him talk, I mean. He was trying to talk to this girl, trying to answer her questions. And these other girls over here in front of us, like, front row, were trying, like, screaming at him, screaming. Like, he was fucking annoyed. I, this is what I don't understand. Like, 
little girls like i hate going to these concerts because it's like why are you like here like you guys are so fucking young like you guys should have been grown by now that's what i mean like i'm i know they have young fans but i didn't think like immature fans like damn i'm like 24 years old and this is what i have to do like i was annoyed i was fucking annoyed and and i hope those girls know no actually i was on twitter and they were like all happy about it they're like no don't said this to me like shut the fuck up i was mad at you guys like fuck you guys for ruining niall's fucking mood and then he sang three songs and he answered questions my question was not answered you were supposed to write a question and put it in the box and he'll pick some and i wrote it in pink paper so like mine could stand out and no it was not picked but yeah sound chip was really fun super fun and i was in the middle second like second row and uh, he's so good looking like i know he looked at me because obviously what i was wearing but during the concert i I put a t-shirt on so don't worry guys i put a t-shirt on i covered up during the concert but it's just i don't know if you guys know this but i met now four times um and the three other times he's always said no to pictures and i've always got like low-key butthurt i'm like oh. i met him in nashville at a bar and i asked for a picture they're like no he's underage he's drinking that's why so i understood that one and then i saw him at the airport and he just said hi i was like oh okay and then um i met him on the las vegas strip and he saw like the fans and he just dipped it i was like oh <laughs> no but he didn't run away he said hi to us he said hi guys and they're like oh can we get a picture and he's like i'm all i have to, i'm in a hurry he said and i so that's why like i'm like i'm gonna dress good i'm gonna dress so good so now i could be like oh, damn i should have took those pictures but um i didn't have a chance to tell him that story obviously because the meeting greet was like 15 seconds long but so worth it so worth it and i'm just i can't believe i met him and hug him twice oh ooh. okay so in the actual concert uh well first of all i hate fucking ga ever since i grew up i hate ga like i think general admission is for teenage girls now like i can't do that anymore that's not me mm-mm if I'm ever going to a GA concert, you'll find me in the back now. Like, all the way in the back. That's where I belong now. Because I am done with little girls. Like, ugh. Like, I honestly thought One Direction fans would have grown up by now. You know? Like, but they're still so young. Like, I was like, I didn't expect these many young girls here. I expected old girls, you know? Like, that was like six years ago, you know? And then, because when I go to the LA shows, like, for any 1D LA show, like, they're pretty grown over there. But here in Vegas, they were young. And then, um, during the concert, I was like, oh, wow, they never scanned my ticket. So I pretty much got in for free. And then I texted my boyfriend, like, oh, do you want to come? Like, you want to come to the concert? He lives right across the venue, like, a five-minute drive. Less than five minutes, like, two-minute drive. And I was like, oh, you want to come? I got, and they never scanned my ticket. You can come if you want. So I just sent, um, I screenshotted the ticket and sent it to him. And then he came in, and I was, like, third from the stage, like, third row, kind of. And oh my god and i was by myself i was with Alyssa, but Alyssa also made friends so she was talking to them and then i was like over here being squished to death and um, i was like just come come fuck it like push people like who gives a fuck like you're gonna be with me you know and then he started you know coming but he didn't push people obviously he was he's a nice guy and then this guy got so fucking pissed that 
he made it to me and all these girls like he can't be here he can't come over here i'm like so like shut the fuck up i'm like shut up like you guys are like these these tall like little girls i'm like you guys could see over him like shut the fuck up like and there's a guy like trying to push my boyfriend and i'm like uh no bye and then my boyfriend pushes his bag and flicks him off. And then the guy, the white guy, he's white, obviously. The white privilege was like, security, security. Um, this guy. And then security comes and he's like, what's the problem? Like he takes my boyfriend out of like the GA area and we go. And I'm like, follow. I'm going to go follow my boyfriend. And Niles performing during this whole drama and i went i'm like i have to get i have my boyfriend's back you know so i went i'm like security what is the problem those people have no reason to be mad and um they were like yeah i get it the security didn't even give a fuck he was like yeah i get it just just go on this side though let's go to the because i was on the right side they were like just go to the left side it's fine like have fun guys and i'm like okay so we just went to the left side in the back, obviously. And it was more fun in the back. I'm telling you guys, GA concerts are so much more fun in the back. We, I actually went to go get a beer. I got low-key tipsy. I got tipsy facts. I haven't been eight since 10 a.m. And now I'll perform at like nine. <laughs> I haven't had eight food in a long time. And then, so yeah, I had a blast in the back. I'm telling you guys don't even i used to wake up like at four in the morning get ready go to the concert at six in the morning just to line up for ga just to be close and that's not even fun anymore guys like that's not fun and then while you're in the front still like people push and there's no room to jump around dance that's the point and everybody just wants to record and it's like i barely recorded because i was like having fun i was jumping i was dancing singing along so that's what concerts are for guys live in the moment just put your phone down and just live in the moment guys like you live this okay, life so my meeting great picture just uploaded to the website and i am obsessed with it like i look so good he looks so good i am so happy with it um i just can't stop thinking about the moment like the way he looked at me he looked at me like straight in the eyes and he looked at you know you know what he looked at yeah it, it made me blush so hard because of that and it sucks I didn't have the chance to tell him about how much I love him, how much he changed me. I have so much to talk to him. I wish I could hang out with him. You know what's my dream? My dream is to go to the bar and get drunk with Niall. Like, he looks like so chill drinking. Like, ooh, oh, he's so handsome. I hugged him. Oh, I'm just so happy. I am just very very happy that i met him and got the opportunity to meet him and yeah so i'm uh, i'm getting ready i'm going out today i'm i posted my picture already on instagram and i wish niall could see it i tagged him but i doubt he'll see it but maybe he'll screenshot it maybe it'll be his wallpaper you never know but i think this is it for the vlog yeah I, I think this is it but i hope you guys liked it i know i didn't really vlog much at the concert because i was living in the moment that's my new thing at concerts live in the moment not through the camera so yeah so i had a amazing time what a ugh, what a great experience I, can, I can't even talk but yeah it was amazing and I'll see you guys in my next video.